Now we will discuss about HTML. In part one, we came to know about HTML, uses of HTML, and importance of HTML. Now, some points, some discussion about HTML. HTML is hypertext markup language. We discussed and we understand in last video. Now, HTML is a tag based language means to write anything to format to make a proper structure we use tag tags are the commands of HTML means without tag we cannot say anything means we cannot develop anything in HTML to write anything to make anything to insert images to insert videos to write just simple text we need some tags and with the help of those tags with the help of attributes of the tags we can decorate them to make the content make the document more attractive and when it comes to the computer a case case sensitive can case sensitivity is the point to be focused means we have to pay attention on the case sensitivity some languages are there they will not understand if you write anything in different case which is required and suppose the language understands a capital letter different a small letter different then you have to write each and everything properly in that format so that that language can understand what you want to say or what you wish to do so HTML is not the case sensitive language you can write in capital you can write in small letters in which you are comfortable you can write and to create HTML documents we need not to purchase any software we need not to purchase any special editor we can simply use our notebook means notepad not notebook notepad in the computers the basic text editor which comes free with our operating system means which comes pre-installed with our operating system we need not to pay attention to install that particular editor so notepad is very easily available text editor which is used and which is very helpful to create html documents and the web pages means uh, in our second point we have written this language is used to develop or design the web pages these web pages are also known as the html documents in last video we discussed about website and web pages also a website is collection of multiple web pages means it is not compulsory ki particular website will contain this number of pages no it is your wish since it is the wish of designer it is wish, it is the wish of owner for them how many pages they wish to have with their website if you wish to have a single page then you'll all then it is the duty of the designer to put your all information within one page in a very attractive ways attractive manner so that your audience your viewers will see the decoration is the main important thing the presentation the decoration if you will write in your copy in a very hazy way your teacher will face lots of problems to check your notebook but if you will write in a very proper manner in a very attractive decorative way definitely your notebook will attract all the teachers so in the same way your html document should attract the audience so this is html and we were discussing about websites websites are also known as the url 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 stands for uniform resource locator and here are some common websites which are being used with by us on a very regular basis nowadays fb.com we have a full url facebook.com a facebook.com facebook.com is also accessible with fb.com means instead of typing facebook.com you may use fb.com also and flipkart online shopping amazon.in online shopping google.co.in our search engine 
and the page dot co dot in indicating that this is for India. Google dot com means it is globally available for any country. Twitter dot com also a social media site just like Facebook. Facebook is also social networking site. Twitter is also social networking site. So these are the websites where very common. There are lots of websites. So we cannot list all the websites here. These are just the common names so that we can understand. Yes, we are familiar with websites. If you are not accessing all these websites, any one of these you have visited, I think. And if, have, if you have not visited any of these, just go and try any website. Then you will come to know what is website, what is web pages. Means you will see a digital document. You may access all these websites in your phone, in your laptop, in your iPad, in your tab, whatever device you have in your computer, in your laptop. So this is HTML. HTML is tag based language, not case sensitive. And the, whatever the web pages are, they are also known as the HTML documents. Okay, next we will discuss in our next video. Thanks.